What's up guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to discuss what is Google My Activity and how to delete your activities from Google's servers. What is Google My Activity? So Google have been storing your activities which you do online like uh, searching on Google website or, or using Google apps like uh, Drive, like uh, Gmail or you know like Google Maps. Whatever you do online are your activities that are actually stored on Google. That's Google actually tracking you. Uh, Google has been doing this for a long time now and the reason for that is because it actually helps Google to improve your online experience like personalize your experience, improve search results, suggest you better uh, search, search terms. So in this video I'm going to tell you how to uh, find out what all activities have been tracked by Google for you and uh, you can actually uh, decide which ones to delete, which ones to keep and actually prevent Google from tracking you further. So let me uh, set up my device and I'll walk you through how you can do that. So you'll have to visit this link myactivity.google.com slash myactivity and you can do this on your computer or on your phone. So this works on uh, both of your devices. So after you have visited this link you can scroll down and see that Google is actually tracking your activities daily. This is my activity that, that I've performed today uh, on YouTube on you know different webs um, different apps or you know whatever I'm, I've been using. If you like to explore one of these activities, then you can actually click on uh, one of these activity and uh, on three dots, click details, and then you can see that you know your activities are listed right there. And if you click on these three dots again, then you can see there is a delete button, uh, which will actually help you to delete this activity, or only this specific activity. So I'm gonna do it. Let's delete this one. So Google is actually explaining you that it's trying to delete all these activities so if I delete it which I'm gonna do it now my Google experience might not be same any longer so I leave that decision on you if you like to delete it or not but this is how you can delete it you know that was a way of deleting uh, one activity but if you like to delete uh, several items together then there's a button on left called delete activity by if you click on that you can delete activity in last hour last day all time or custom range if you click on custom range you can put some dates before and after date and Google will actually delete all the activities within that range and if you click on all time then Google will actually delete everything that it has recorded over the time for you. I'm not gonna do it now but uh, you know for just an example I'm gonna show deleting activity of last hour so just click delete and confirm all your last hour activity has been deleted. If you click on other Google activity link on left you can see there are a lot of things that Google is actually tracking like your YouTube history, your location history, your ad settings, your comments on YouTube videos, your likes, dislikes, your purchase activity, your uh, surveys that you have done for Google, like lots and lots of things. And you can individually select, you know, um, these items also, you know, just similar to the process that I showed before. You just click on manage activity and uh, click, you know, just delete that item that you don't want to share, don't want to store. And additionally, there is another way of deleting um, activities for you, which you can do by going under activity controls on left. And you see there is a button called manage activity under web and app activity section. So click on that. And if you scroll a little, then you can see uh, there is a button called choose to delete automatically. So, so this actually allows you to automatically delete your activities. For example, if you uh, select this button, your activities will be deleted after 18 months and if you select this one, your activities will be deleted after 3 months. Whatever option you decide, uh, just click next and your activities will be deleted after that period. I'm gonna select this one because I like to uh, keep my activities until you know I, I delete them manually myself. And the last thing I'm gonna discuss in this video is to how to prevent Google from actually tracking it at the first place. So for that, you will have to click this button called change setting. So once you click on that, you'll have to untoggle this, this box and Google will actually stop monitoring and stop tracking your activities further when you confirm by clicking the pause button. And you can see the, the tracking has been paused and my activities will not be saved on Google server any longer. But that might also mean my online uh, search experience, my you know personalized experience that is provided by Google might not be the same anymore. But hey, uh, you can come back again and you can turn it on if you like, you know, if your experience has degraded. And this is pretty much it from this video. I hope this video was helpful for you. And if it was, give me a like and subscribe to my channel. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video.